I can assure you that the Bank of Uganda will do everything possible to ensure the continued safety of customers' deposits and the soundness of the entire financial sector. The governor on Tuesday categorically stated that Crane Bank was not in any financial distress and that the central bank was monitoring its operations. This statement, however, has changed. The Bank of Uganda governor, Emmanuel Tumusime Mutabile, says the bank has failed to meet the required capital standard of 50% to operate and has been taken over by the regulator. But what does this mean to the customers? Crane Bank will remain open, but customers will be free to withdraw their money and move to other banks. This will be done under the supervision of the regulator, Bank of Uganda. Also, those servicing loans have to go on until they complete them as the bank seeks to have an investor buy it off. Addressing a news conference in Kampala, Mutebile refuted allegations that the central bank had asked customers to withdraw their savings. Upon a determination by the Bank of Uganda, the Screen Bank Limited is a significantly undercapitalized institution as defined by law possesses a systemic risk, the stability of the financial system, and that the continuation of current bank activities in its current form is detrimental to the interests of the depositors in the bank. Considered the third largest bank in Uganda, Crane Bank reported a consolidated pre-tax loss of 7.353 billion shillings in 2015 compared to a 57.066 billion shillings profit in 2014 after reporting a rise in expenses and impairment losses on loans and advances. Assets at the end of 2015 were 1.810 trillion shillings. The bank, which was set up in 1995, was offering corporate and retail services with a focus on micro, small and medium-sized businesses. Crane Bank has been on the Bank of Uganda watch list since September 2015 after regulator on-set tests and external audit report. Crane Bank capital had fallen below the 50% legal requirement under the law. Meanwhile, all that sit on the board of directors of Crane Bank have been suspended as per Governor Emmanuel Mutebile's announcement that Bank of Uganda has taken over. Mutebile further noted that BOU is to conduct an audit on Crane Bank to determine whether the bad debts contributed to capital erosion. A letter addressed to Crane Bank's acting managing director and dated October 20th read, and I quote, This is to inform you that Bank of Uganda has with effect from today, 20th, 2016, percent to section 873881A and B of the Financial Institutions Act 2004 taken over management of Crane Bank Limited. You are accordingly suspended from your position as acting managing director and you are required to make a formal handover of your responsibilities to the Bank of Uganda statutory manager Mr. Edward Katimbo Mugwanya end of quote. In 2014, Global Trust Bank was closed after it made a loss of 60 billion shillings. By press time, some customers were seen at the different branches seeking to get their money back. Reporting for Urban TV, I'm Simon Octella.